reasons why I believe it's so important for the church to open is because we just go to the Bible for the illustration. That on the day of Pentecost, God birthed His church when everybody was together. I mean, He could have put a fire on everybody individually in their homes, but it doesn't work like that. Because everybody that brays, bray flays in South Africa knows you put the coals together. And while they are together, they glow bright and red and strong. You put one of them there, just a little bit. Isolation, depression, anxiety, disconnection. We are designed to be together. The Bible says the church is built a dwelling place of God by the Holy Spirit. So as much as people come and say, well, we are the church. Like a yay. It's like saying, I'm going to have a bright place and I'm not going to put the coals together. I'm going to put one coal in my living room, one ca- uh, cow, <laughs> one coal over there and I'm going to light the fire. It's not going to work. It's not going to work. And as much as we thank God for technology, technology is never going to place Quinonia. It's not, let's, let's not, let's not be hypocritical when it comes to the church of Jesus and everybody makes a sound and has an opinion. There's a pattern. In the Old Testament, God built a tabernacle and everybody that sought God had to go to the tabernacle. Had to go to the priest. New Testament, we understand that the body of Jesus that was broken is the tabernacle. And our access into the presence of God is through the blood of Jesus Christ. Yet, same Hebrews chapter 10 that talks about access into the presence of God. Talks about not neglecting the assembling of yourselves together. Because that's where we fellowship. Not just upward, but vertical horizontally as well that's the church our father we're not going to experience the fullness of god while we live in isolation if we're going to be half smart we're going to shout out every voice that is trying to keep us isolated and separated and we are going to pray for the church those of us who understand what the church is oh we know it's not a building but it is when people come together and they fellowship together the same people that say that the church should not be open are people that post on social media they Christmas pictures where they were together as families. And they say, I'm so grateful for my family. And Jesus says, they are my family. Those who hear the word and do the word, they are my family. So if you believe that churches should not open, then please do not have any physical relationship with your sons and your daughters, your husbands, your wives, or anybody any longer. Just talk to them on social media. And let's see how well that goes. And the church is above that. 